everybody. So I'm still here at uh, Nikki and John's with Val playing camera stand right now because she doesn't feel well and we are on our way to urgent care uh, in Pasadena. So um, yeah, we'll let you know what's going on as soon as we know. Hey guys, so here I am once again in urgent care in pain. It sounds like it's a uh, can a stone again. Yeah, but a big be one. A stone, and it might be a big one because usually I can pass them on my own. But this is I'm in so much pain this time, and I'm having some other issues also. They're waiting for um, my urine test to come back, and then they're probably going to do a CAT scan. Is that what she's saying? No, a um, ultrasound. Ultrasound. An ultrasound. Um, just to make sure just that's nothing more serious or anything like that. Well, we've been having a heck of a day. Val so, um, went in for a ultrasound. ultrasound. I went running for some lunch and um, been kind of chasing her around the facility here for a while. And some, where at some point we dropped, we left the camera somewhere. So I guess the place is uh, small enough, we had no problem. Uh, well, the security guard had it. He, he recognized us from the videos, I guess. So I was the guy he yelled at when I was trying to get back into uh, urgent care. So He must he recognized my hat because he saw my hat. And he's like, is this yours? And I'm like, yes, it's mine and my husband's. So we don't know what's going on yet. We haven't really heard anything. Um, it, it could be a um, I don't know. Stone. I don't want to speculate anything. All I know Let's is, speculate. All I know is the gentleman who did my ultrasound asked <clears throat> me if I work. Yeah, I guess think you're not going to be going to work for a while. <laughs> so... I don't know. I don't know if he was just having conversation or what, but it was when he was finishing up, he says, do you work? I said, no, I'm completely disabled. So, and that's how it was left. So, <laughs> I don't know what that meant. I don't know anything. So, we'll see what happens. Hey. Go ahead, speculate. All right, so let's see. We have uh, a number one, probably the most likely, is uh, a kidney stone. And a big one this time because this is really hurting bad. Well, she passes them off then, but this is a doozy, right? Could be gallbladder, which would mean surgery. Or it could be our old friend um, scar tissue, which could be attached to certain things and pulling on them. So we may be uh, putting her in surgery. Maybe nothing. Maybe all in my head. Well, maybe they'll replace that too. <laughs> so your problem is there's a reindeer eating your head. Very nice, dear. So. Well guys, we're getting closer. They want to do a CT scan now. Um, they are pretty sure it's a kidney stone. They are positive I have what's called hydroneurosis, which is something is backing up into my kidney and causing my kidney to become inflamed. Yay! <laughs> Hey, at least it's not my gallbladder and I don't need surgery. <laughs> Yay! Okay, guys, so we finally got back from the doctor. We stopped by Chinese, got Val her favorite soup, although this one wasn't as tasty as her, the ones at home. So, but what can you do when we don't know where we're, the good ones are? So, um, she has uh, kidney stones, so essentially my, my wife is stoned. Both sides. You've got kidney stones coming out 
both kidneys. Only one of them seems to be giving you trouble so far. So far. Um, I was laying in the hospital and the other side started hurting a little bit, but I thought eh, it was just because I've been laying on that side and babying the other side, so I didn't think anything of it. And then after they did, first they did an ultrasound and couldn't find the, the um, stones, but they did determine that my kidneys, or my right kidney was inflamed and swollen and that is called what was the for hydro nephritis hydro nephritis nephritis or something like that and um since they didn't see a kidney stone and they know they found <clears throat> my kidney to be swollen and inflamed they had to do a cat scan because they had to find out what is causing my kidney to be inflamed and sure enough, that's when they found that I have kidney stones in both sides. And that's what's causing the pain, and that's what's causing my kidneys to swell. And it's causing, it could cause my face, which my face to me has been swollen for several days now. They, I asked how long it normally takes to pass kidney stones and they said it can take anywhere from I could pass them today or tomorrow up to a month so let's hope it's sooner than later because I can't handle this pain for a whole month well we take the Flonase and drink lots of fluids Flomax Flonase is for <laughs> your nose I don't think squirting something up my nose is gonna help it come out my uh <clears throat> you know my pee pee any sooner <laughs> okay is that under the category of tmi <laughs> so all right so we're home we're gonna settle in for a little while and then see what's next <laughs> right guys I'm in pain. That's how I'm doing. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. I'm not the one who's stoned. I wish I was stoned, then maybe I wouldn't be in pain. <laughs> oh, this sucks, guys. This really sucks. Those of you who past kidney stones or who have had past kidney stones whatever know how this feels it's, not me it's not fun never done it it's not fun I, I it hurts worse than my feet well get your mind off your feet then anyway i think we're gonna call it a night night mm -hmm. And I'm going to bed. Yes, I know it's early, but I'm going to take my medicine and I'm going to go to bed. Okay. So, if you liked a little bit of something that you saw in the video today, if you like seeing me in pain, <laughs> if you like seeing me suffer, <laughs> Please give this video a great big thumbs up, a like, a share, a comment, all that happy, crappy stuff. And Rudolph and Kevin and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.